Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Firebase Firestore Fast API. Today we are going to learn Firebase Firestore CRUD operation using the Fast API and the Python. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share, and comment on my video. Let's get started. So first of all, let me just copy this. We have full fledged CRUD in the read. Let me just copy this all and go to our code. Okay, so just hide this. And just close this. Okay. Now we will start with this. Okay, let's go to the certificate we need to pass. So let's add the certificate over here. So here let's add the credentials path. So here we go with the Firebase, right? So done. Okay, Control C again. We can reload. Okay. So now reload this, and we have all the, of that one. Okay. So first of all, we are going to create it. So we require the name and the description. Let's try it out. The name and the description both. Let's try to execute it. And here we go. Let's go to the Firebase and let's go to the Fire Store and let's check the records. So here we have a create items, post items. Okay, so items should be there. So let's go check the items. Here we have the items, and here you can see that the AA is there, right? Let's move to the next one. So this is done. Now we are going to get item by ID. In the last video we received the ID or not? I think yes. So let's copy, retrieve this by ID. So here we go with try it out. Let's add the ID and let's execute this. And here we go with the A credentials we get it. Okay. Next we try to update that one. Okay. So let's try it out with this record and let's check with BB I will put okay let's execute this and here we go with this one and let's you can see vv is updated with that id right next and the last one that is gonna be one more i think might be okay so try it out with the, this details and execute it and here you can see that there is a no data over here that means it is deleted right okay so i think we have the get all items yeah, the first one get all read all items right so this is pending so let's try it out and execute and here we have all the details of that one right okay so let's dive into the code level how we have implemented this so here we have the import the fast api from the fast api and that should be exception Firebase admin, we import credentials, Firestore, initialize app, pandemic, we are using a base model, and the form of typing, we import the optional and the list. So initialize the fast API app, initialize the Firebase admin SDK with the help of this. Now model for the data, so name and the description we want, then create operation for db.collection.items document. So here we are create operation for whatever data we are fetched. So item dictionary is dumped. So let's add the model dump. Okay. So this is the create part. Next we have a read operations to get a single item. So here we have a dot items document ID. So here we require the item ID if and get that one. If the document exists, then we are returning else exception that item not found. Next, we have a update an item with item ID. First, we check that the document ID is there or not. If not, we will say that the item not found. If exist, then we are going to update that one. Set that item with the dictionary. Whatever dictionary we receive, we just directly update that dictionary. Okay. This is also with this one, right? Moving to the next that we have a delete operation. So db.collection get the document ID and if the document exists, then delete it. Else 
it will show me that the item not found okay so the operation to get all the items so read all the items we have make the array and db dot collection dot item stream then we are looping over here and append to the dictionary and return all the items okay so this is how you can do with that part any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day